guys. I guess this is sort of an intro. I just finished packing because I am going to Japan. Wee! I had a very, very long day today, but I wanted to say goodnight before I said good morning because I'm definitely going to be tired and grumpy tomorrow. I'm going to bed now and I will see you tomorrow morning when I head to the airport. We are currently at the gate waiting to board, but I have some time. So I thought I would do a what's in my bag. This one is from Set. First things first, this pillow. I don't go anywhere without this pillow. I just got this camera. I have many of these. I have this one, I have this one, my digital that everyone loves, and then the one I'm using right now. So I have four cameras on me. Power bank, of course all the chargers I'll ever need. Headphones, hand cream, salt and stone rose hand cream. This one's my all-time favorite. Gentle Monster glasses, tripod, of course, some sanitizing wipes. Don't be disgusting, guys. Wipe things down. Passport, wallet, gum. If you're Chinese, you probably know this. Helps with any sort of sickness, plane sickness, car sickness. It just smells like Vicks, honestly, but with the Asian twist. Last couple of things, hand sanitizer, and of course, handy dandy sleeping mask. That's everything in here. Just thought I'd show you a quick what's in my bag since I feel like a lot of people ask me in my most recent video. Anyways, that's it. Sim bought our tickets to Kyoto and now we are heading to the hotel finally. That flight was long, 14 hours. I was like, this is gonna be so easy. No, 14 hours is different. Also American Airlines, Bye. count your days. We made it to the hotel. This is my quick room tour. The bathroom, very clean. Bathtub, bidet of course. This is the bed with the PJs, yay. I am gonna change, relax for a bit, and they actually offer tea service in the lobby for people who stay at the hotel. So I think I'm gonna go downstairs and get a cup of matcha because I need that boost of energy right now. Pretty tired. Got ready really quickly. Now we're gonna go to the lobby for some matcha. First unigiri of the trip. I got tuna mayo. I always get tuna mayo. Perfect snack before dinner. I don't know if I mentioned this, but we're walking to a clothing store called Capital. This is so cute. Look at the pattern. I wish I could show you guys the shirt. I should have, but it was a very impulsive buy for me because my boyfriend found jeans and I was like, maybe I should get something. I'm still so tired. This is the dinner spot. So everything on the menu is in Japanese. So both. Both of us, we just showed her a picture. We're like, can we get this one? I'm stealing his highball. I feel like it's like the thing to drink here. I believe this is chowder. We just got off a plane. Anything that's soupy is very comforting. Hamburger meat. It's a very savory. Gravy. I am back at the hotel 
I changed into the PJs that they left for us and showered, did my skincare, ready for bed. Dinner was okay, but it was nice because it was super easy and comfortable. That's it for today. Good night, guys. Japan. First stop is going to be 7-Eleven because I have a really bad headache and I need to buy an umbrella for this weather but I already see what I want. Two, Two egg ones. The umbrella has been secured but no medication. I had to ask the guy that worked there where I can go get some Tylenol and so he helped me map it and it's a 10 minute walk. Found it. I should have probably eaten first and then taken my Tylenol, but my headache is killing me. Egg sandwich. And I don't know if you guys have seen the hack, but you put a slice of fried chicken in the middle. I got the spicy one, of course. I get it. We are finally walking to the market. That was a very long detour actually, but at least the sandwich was yummy. We have the tamago guys. Wait, look at how fluffy it is. It's a very sweet egg. Also has like a slight dashi flavor. Got some tuna. This was 20 bucks. I don't know if it's worth $20, but it's good. It's Mr. Swirly. We got a beef bowl. So far, free tea. I was desperately in need of a coffee, so got an iced latte with honey. Oh, yeah, literally perfect. at the coffee shop now we're heading over to this denim store that i really wanted to check out it's called betty smith Episu, and you can customize your jeans hey guys i'm so excited you can't go in unless you book an appointment and they're all booked up Lesson learned, if you want to come, make sure you book online. I can even link it down below. First bite. That is really good. I recommend this place, it's good. It is. Pretty cute for fall time. Free pen. Home from all the shopping. My hair looks insane. Gonna take a mini break and then we're probably gonna head back out for more shopping. Outfit change. Oh my god, I'm so excited. It's the Kiko store. I didn't want to get my hopes up because today everything's been closed, but look how cool this store is. just finished at Kiko and I bought those blue sneakers because they were so comfy and I think that they would be great for New York winter. My boyfriend also got a pair so we'll be matching but 
We actually just parted ways because he's gonna go get a haircut and I asked the girl who worked at Kiko to recommend me a store and she says that there's a really cute vintage store right down the street. club went home changed again because we were drenched from the rain and now we're just finding a place close by to the hotel for dinner back from dinner showered once again i wanted to debrief on dinner because I surprisingly really enjoyed it. The soba noodles were so chewy. If you like your noodles al dente, that's your spot. Anyways, that's it for today. For now, I'm gonna get some rest and I will see you guys tomorrow morning. Good morning, everyone. Second day in Tokyo. <sighs> Time to get ready. Look at this toothbrush that I brought from home. Stop. Isn't she so cute? It's so pretty early though. So I'm not sure what we're gonna do. I always bring new skincare products when I go travel and sometimes I discover new ones that I really love. This cleanser, it's so good. It's not drying. The little beads, okay. And it smells so, so good. Skin is clean. Now I'm going in with another new favorite product and it's this creamy toner I don't like to layer too many layers of skincare in the morning so this almost feels like my skin is already moisturized this is my last skincare discovery product from Beauty of Joseon which is their Relief Sun Aqua Fresh sunscreen it's like much lighter I can literally pat it in and it leaves no white cast and it's not sticky. That's all for skincare. I'm gonna do my makeup now. So this is the before. After. I even changed into my outfit for today. Look how cute. I'm already wearing the new shoes. I think I like the one from yesterday more, but it's over there. Finished at the first coffee shop. Now we are heading to the second one of the day. To a random coffee shop. This is so cute. Everyone's sitting outside enjoying their coffee. It's so hot. I'm so sweaty. I got another iced latte. Very good. Actually delicious. I got a natural lemonade. I'm not sure what that means. Whoa, this is really good. This is actually better than the coffee, and the coffee is already really good. So now we're gonna walk to ramen, and that's gonna probably be a 30 minute walk to the ramen shop. I'm so tired. It's very strong dasha. into a another comfy outfit 
because I was honestly so sweaty in that pink dress, but I put my hair up. I am ready to go. We're gonna go have omakase tonight. I'm sorry, I'm not used to the malls in Asia, but this is insane. We're sat, ready to eat some sushi. I'm so excited. <laughs> from izakaya that was very yummy <laughs> now it's time for bed i think this is going to be the end of the first part of tokyo so i hope you guys enjoyed and we will continue our adventures in the next video thank you for watching and i will see you guys very soon